I'm just like watching YouTube videos while I wait for my brother to finish. I don't know what he's doing, but I feel like it's awkward when I'm talking and then people are outside. Hey friends, it's Haylini here. I'm back with another video. Today's video is actually a Korean beauty unboxing. I have been so behind in my Etude House unboxings for the Pink Bird program. Um, I've actually haven't done the September one and the October one, so I'm doing like a double feature of them today. Luckily, my exams are completely over, and now I've just got about one month of completely free time before I go to Japan, and I'll do some more videos and vlogs there. And then when I come back, I'm gonna actually be starting work, so I guess this is the time where I'm gonna start pumping out all those videos. Mm. I was also thinking of changing my background. I don't know, to make it look a bit more simple, clean, and aesthetic, but... Yeah, I don't know, you guys let me know, because right now it's kind of messy. Apart from that, we've got two boxes to review today from Etude House, so I think we might as well just jump straight into it. So, starting with the first box. So this is actually the September box, and now it's November, that's pretty slack of me to review it so late, I'm so sorry. But, better late than never, that's what they say. So the little flyers that they sent me are here, the three, so we have a read of those. So there's the 120 hour Skin Chase Moist Stalker Cream. This is the Moistful Collagen Cream. And something I want to mention is that the Moistful Collagen Cream is so popular. I think it's one of the best sellers in Etude House. Um, I read somewhere that like one gets sold every... Actually, I might need to check that fact because I don't want to make something up and then be wrong. Um, I'll check it on my phone. Okay, so this is incredible. This is a really good fact, guys. The Moistful Collagen Cream, it says, In Etude House Korea, one jar of this cream is actually sold every 10 seconds. How crazy is that? So let's have a look at the actual products. First, we'll start with the samples. These are really good to use for when you go on holidays. And you're not allowed to take too high volume liquids with you on the plane and stuff. You can just take these little travel size samples. Oh yeah, um, friends, if you're watching this, <laughs> I hope you are. If you guys want any, I always carry these around with me, so like whenever you see me in real life, just let me know and I'll just give you a few. The Moistful Collagen Cream is essentially a, a moisturizing cream that you use on your face. It works really well in moisturizing, keeping that balance in the skin and making sure that the skin is kept youthful and really, I guess, elasticized. So what else they gave me was ah, two of these, yay! Two skincare kits, they're both the same. Moistful Collagen, um, Moistful Collagen Skincare Kit only for Sweetie. I'm not sure what that means, but uh, there's four products in this kit. They're all sample sized. I think I might actually do a giveaway for this one. So I'll put it up with my blog link whenever I plug this video in my blog. So yeah, if there's a giveaway, it'll be in the description. This skincare kit has these four items. Aren't they cute? The first one looks like this. Uh, yep, there we go. That is a facial toner. So usually I use the facial toner after I've cleansed and moisturized. And then the facial toner just um, ensures that there's a balance of pH levels and it also softens the skin. The second item, similar looking, it's an emulsion. It's a moisturizing emulsion that applies light that applies lightly and provides a moisturized finish. This is the really popular item. This is the Moistful Collagen Cream. It comes in such a little tub, but if you get it um, as a full-size product, I think it's actually like 60 grams or something. It's a lot bigger than this one, and it'll last you quite a while. And then the last one is an essence containing a high amount of super collagen water that fills the inside of the skin with abundant moisture. For me, I have really dry skin. Um, you guys probably can't tell on screen cam. The silver lining is that I don't really get um, too many breakouts that easily but then my mom tells me like if you have dry skin then you're gonna get wrinkles really easily in the future. It's extremely important that we use um, these beauty products like the moisturizing creams and the essences in order to keep the skin looking young. So the last product in the September box was this uh, Precious BB Cover and Bright Fit BB Cream. So it's got a triple function in that it has wrinkle improvement, whitening, and it's also got an SPF of 30. Uh, it comes in three shades, just as usual. So there's the light beige, the natural beige, and the honey beige. 
Uh, you guys can pick that based on whatever color you think suits you the best. It looks like this. And it smells pretty good as well. It smells, smells kind of like cinnamon, I think. Right now, I'm actually wearing it. It's not too heavy on the skin. It also isn't too drying because I found that the cotton BB cream that I use right now is actually a little bit dry for my skin and I needed something that was a little bit more moisturizing just because my particular skin type is so dry. So this one will probably be a lot better for me. And you guys can see a little swatch that I'm going to do right now. So I've got this etude written out on my hand and I'm just going to cover it up with this BB cream. You can probably see that it's doing a pretty good job. I have to layer it on a bit though. But there's a really good strong coverage on this. Okay, great. So that was the first box. Let's now move on to the second box, which is the October one. I'm always super excited when it comes to the October boxes because they always seem to have this Halloween theme to them. And I really love looking at the themed makeup that Etude House creates. So, within this we have some bubble wrap. So satisfying. Um, the pink letter, as usual. And there are five products in here. First of all, we have this awesome little pack of nail stickers and nail covers. I think nail wraps are a lot easier to use than actual nail polish just because they don't tend to chip so much. I mean, look at my nails right now. That's disgusting. That's after two days of wearing that. So these ones don't chip. You can just peel them off when you don't want to wear them anymore. And they're pretty easy to put on. I would probably use them in conjunction with this nail polish. So this is a Halloween edition of the Play Nails in the Etude House line. This particular line is called Witch and the City and it has a little bit of like nice decoration around the exterior and the actual nail polish itself is really cute because it's kind of like dark, sophisticated and it's also got a touch of glitter in it. And then this is the Fantastic Color Eyes Hello Pump Queen eyeshadow set from Etude House. So there's six shades, they're all quite orangey. Uh, browns. The first one is Cacao Fondue. I think you can use it more as an eyeliner. It's got a really dark brown, gelish kind of consistency to it, whereas the other ones are more powder type makeup. So the second uh, shade is Brown Sugar. It's brown, it's got a tiny bit of sparkle on it. The third shade is Pearl Lantern. It's really lovely. It's like peachy, orange, super glittery. The fourth shade is Honey Pumpkin. That's a matte orangey brown. Uh, the fifth shade is caramelizing. It's also a nice golden brown tone with a bit of shimmer in it. And then the last one is called a piece of pie. And that's a similar shimmer to the caramelizing shade, except it's just a darker color. So the last two items are both variations of the Dear My Enamel Lips Talk. They're all lipsticks, but they've also got this lip gloss shine to them where Etude has combined like the technology of lip gloss and the actual lipstick into one product. There's 10 different shades. Today I received the pink, the PK004 and the RD303. Today I'm wearing the PK004. It came out a little bit darker than I expected. You guys can have a look at the actual shade. So it looks like that, right? But when I put it on my lips, it's a little bit darker. But that's awesome because I really wanted a lipstick exactly this shade pretty much. It kind of reminds me of like Kylie Jenner lips. And then the second Dear My Enamel Lips Talk product was the RD303. So this is a much darker shade of red. I don't know if it'll focus. Yeah, there we go. So yeah, it looks like that. It comes out really dark and bold on the lips. It's super pretty. I love it. So that was everything in both my pink boxes from the September and October Etude House pink box. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to leave a like, comment and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys in my next video. See ya. Smiling every day with Hey Linny.